I went to a pretty popular club in Gangnam two years ago. It was a bouncer who looked at my friend who said, oh, there's like people in your group that can't come in. And the bouncer like leans forward and he meets eyes with me and he like looks me up and down. Um, and he's like dress code. It's pretty common to say like, oh, there are too many foreigners or um, you can't come in, but then seeing um, white individuals in the club are being let in or let out. No, 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 you better not let her in. There's no way to do let her in and you won't let us in. A lot of times it's on black and brown foreigners to have the sixth sense to know that they're going to be discriminated again. They're playing black music and they're racist. Hello, my dear humans. Today I'm gonna speak about racism and colorism in South Korean society. In South Korea, colorism, which is discrimination against skin color, is very high, both in younger and older generations. Even new generations discriminate based on skin color. Racism is quite low when compared to the colorism, but it is quite high, guys. They show racism to countries. India, Pakistan, Philippines, Thailand, Bangladesh, Africa, Vietnam, North Korea, mostly the dark, dark skin colored countries. They look up the Western countries with white skin color. South Korean peoples discriminate against dark skin. They feel like superiority complex because of their white skin color. If you have the light and glowing skin, it is a privilege in South Korea. Dark skin people they treat like untouchable. Dark skinned people won't fit in Korean society. They show racism explicitly, guys. They mention signboards that people from India, Pakistan were not allowed to pubs, etc. <laughs> This is rule. It's a racism. But guys, it did not complete. Even people from the United States with the black skin color were not allowed to pops. They also face the same type of racism that other dark skin countries face. South Korea is all about looks. How better you look? How was the discrimination against the dark skin people? Finding a part time job is hard. Finding full time job is also questionable in some fields like the service and entertainment sectors, etc. Making friends is also hard, guys. Let me tell you, let me tell you a few experiences that dark skin people has received. A person with the dark skin has gone to the clothing store and touched them. Immediately, the staff came and dusted them, and she left. Even in the subway, they, even if there is an empty seat beside them, no one will sit. Instead, they will sit. They will stand. Mainly African people. They say no job, even though they wear a job. It is really hard for them. Many people from other countries come to Korea for education, but they also face many troubles as a student and there is a personal isolation. 
from the society is that you can't fit in the Korean society. Many people from other countries visit Korea because of the thing like K-pop and k dramas etc. But however, the Koreans hasn't kept up with the racism or the diversity or the colorism etc. Discrimination against dark skin and white skin privilege is very common in South Korea. I believe people in all countries have a right to visit any country in the world. And there shouldn't be any discrimination against race or skin or any other thing. No human is superior than the other human and all the countries are equal. This world exists on correlation between all the countries. Each and every country contributes something to science or technology or philosophy or arts, etc. Whatever the knowledge we have on here is all we achieve combinedly. So each and every person in this earth has a right to question or to fight against any kind of discrimination in any of the country or place. So treat each and every country or a person or an individual with respect. If there are flaws, point out. That way we can make the better future and better world. Have a nice day.